interesting one because actually before any vaccine or drug can be given to people, it must go through lots of rigorous testing. And all the usual steps were followed for the COVID vaccines. It's just that they were developed at a much faster pace than normal. So to understand why it seems so fast, you need to understand why vaccine production and, and testing is usually so slow. Basically, it just takes a really long time to apply and get funding for studies. This causes delays between each phase of the study and it can be challenging and time consuming to try and recruit enough volunteers for trials. And you've also got to apply for ethics for each stage. And then you've got further delays with the manufacturer. In the emergency created by the COVID-19 pandemic, the scientists, doctors, ethics approval boards, manufacturers and regulatory agencies all came together to work harder and faster. And there was a massive response from the public with volunteers coming forward in really large numbers to help with the trials. And scientists have been sharing knowledge very openly and promptly during the pandemic. And this meant that the vaccine targets were also identified very quickly. So the clinical trials and the phases were all able to run in parallel, which me meant the whole process, although it was followed, was very, very much sped up. Development was super fast and it shows us what we're capable of when we all work together to address a common need.